You can also add offset outlines to designs. These are outlines that are not right at the edge of the object, but instead offset a given distance from the object. First, select the objects that you want to add an outline to. Then select outlines and offsets. Uncheck object outlines and place a check mark by offset outlines. Enter the offset that you wish to use. In this case, I'm going to add MM because I'm not in the metric system. Then choose the number of outlines you want around the object. A positive offset places the outlines around the outside of an object. A negative offset will place them inside the object. Choose the type of stitch that you want and all 12 types of stitches can be used and then choose the color. You have two choices when you have multiple objects in your selection. The first will add offset outlines around all selected object. This is called individual. The second is common where the intersected offsets are combined into a single outline. Click OK to add the outlines. For this next group of objects, select them, click on Outlines and Offsets. This time, let's choose Common Offsets and click OK. You can see that the outlines do not go through the objects. With this object, we'll apply a negative offset. And you can see the outlines are added within the object. I could also choose to add an object outline and click OK. And you'll see that an outline is added around the outside of the object, right on the edge, as well as the offset outlines within the object. Next, choose the object with a hole and click on Outlines and Offsets. First, uncheck Include Holes and change the offset back to a positive offset. You'll notice that the software remembers any settings that you had. I'm also going to uncheck Object Outlines and click OK. And you can see that the outlines were not added within the hole. Let's undo that, select the object again, and this time place a check mark by Include Holes and click OK. Here the outlines are added around the object as well as inside the object. There are also different ways to treat the corners of the offset outlines. The first is a round corner. Select round corners and click OK. And you can see that the corners are rounded around this object. With this object, let's select sharp corners and click OK. And you can see that you'll have sharp corners around your offsets. The third type will cut acute angles of 20 degrees or less. Select the object, click on Outlines and Offsets, and this time select Cut Sharp Corner. Click OK, and you can see that the corners were cut for the acute angles. You can also add outlines to lettering. Select the letter, click on Outlines and Offsets, and we're going to change the offset to one millimeter. Include holes is checked, so the outlines will be added within the openings of the letter. Click OK, and you can see that outlines were added both inside and outside the letter. You have lots of choices when it comes to adding offset outlines to objects in the software.